This video is not financial advice. I am not a financial planner. I'm an entertainer. The one, the only, a father in a minivan. Wow! So I've come to the conclusion, there's no more doubt in my mind, that the ape, the AMC ape family is comprised in half. It's like cut in half. Like, you know how you cut a cake in half? Okay. One part of it are good people, you know, that are just a united ape family. They got each other's back. I buy when I can for you. I hold for you. You hold for me. We all have the same mission to win this war, become millionaires, beat the hedge funds. Then there's the other side. Which I guess to a certain degree they want to buy and hold and they want to become successful too. But they truly don't believe in an ape movement. They don't even call themselves apes. They're embarrassed by the term ape. And a lot of them, especially the, you know, obviously the AMC uh, YouTubers are the most biggest, pathetic human beings, cloud chasers out there. Like they just, I, I'm convinced at this point they'll cloud chase o over anything. Over anything. Like, let me give you an example. Tendi Time <clears throat> just puts out a video that he's showing Lou, <clears throat> excuse me, damn sinuses. He's showing Lou the number that called him that, you know, obviously pretended to be Lou. Now, that's all fine and dandy. I got no problem with that. But here's the thing. He starts showing other numbers, right? And he's saying, these are the people that called him who were harassing him. So one of the numbers was from, I think, I think he said, San Antonio, Texas. So Phil For Real decides to make a comment, okay? He says, you know who's from San Antonio, Texas? American Dream, okay? So once again, this is what these people do. It's, they're really low lives. It's, it's terrible. It's like they, they make up these lies that they can't prove. There's no facts behind them. <laughs> and then they try to use it either to clout chase or for whatever the reason is for hate. These are the people that are talking about they hate hate. I mean, Phil, let me ask you a question. Do you have proof? Okay. Do you have proof that American Dream made this call? Can you prove it? Okay. So don't you feel in a way that's prejudiced, right? Think about this. Don't you feel that's racist? Don't you feel that's hate? Because you're accusing a man of doing something that you have no proof that he did. So I could, the only logical conclusion that I could come to is you're doing it out of hate. You hate American Dream. For whatever, maybe you hate him because he's white. Maybe you hate him because he's a supporter of the ape father. Whatever the case may be, you hate him. So you're accusing a man that you have no proof, no proof whatsoever of doing something that he probably didn't do, Phil, okay? So this is what I'm saying, you're all hypocrites. You go around, you call me the hate father, you call me racist, right? You call me all these things when you're describing yourself, Phil. You, you're the racist, Phil. You're the hater, Phil, okay? You are. That's all I have to say.